Hello Google, please turn on the MCB. All right, turning on MCB. Hello Google, please turn off the MCB. Okay, turning off MCB. You just now noticed that on my voice command, how I turned on and off this MCB. With the help of this video, we are going to understand the working and wiring of this Wi-Fi MCB. We will also learn how we are going to connect this MCB with Google. Okay, let's start the video. Friends, you may have seen many types of MCB and you switch on MCB manually. Similarly, you switch off MCB manually. But this Wi-Fi MCB can be automatically switched on or switched off by just sitting in any corner of our room. This Wi-Fi MCB which I am displaying right now is a two-pole MCB which means we can automatically control phase supply and neutral supply. To connect this Wi-Fi MCB with Wi-Fi, a module is provided here that is Wi-Fi module. With the help of this module, only we switch on and off this MCB. This MCB which I have right now is manufactured by CNC company. You can also see the model number here. You can see something written over here that is C63. This means the rating of this MCB is 63 ampere which is of C type. Connection of this MCB is as simple as you do the connection of any normal MCB. What are we going to do is we will connect phase supply to this terminal. You can see N is written over here. So I am connecting neutral supply to this terminal. So you need to do connection in this manner. Now we will directly connect the load at the output terminals. For now, I am connecting a lamp so that you can understand easily and clearly. I connected the phase supply and neutral supply to the output terminals of MCB. Now our connection is completed and if I switch on this MCB, you can see the lamp is on now. If I switch off MCB, the lamp is switched off. If you directly want to operate this MCB with the help of cell phone, then first open Play Store. After that, type in the search box Tuya, T U Y A. Now download this app. After downloading this app, when you open it, select Agree. After that, you will be asked to log in or sign up. Or try now you have to select the sign up option if you are using this MCB fill all the details after signing up now you can see an option over here that is add device on clicking to this you will be asked to give location permission so you have to give this permission after that you see options like this now you have to search breaker Wi-Fi you can see it is written here when you click on this you will be asked to connect your device with Wi-Fi MCB. You will receive the signal of the Wi-Fi networks available. The name of my home Wi-Fi network is electrical, so it is showing here. You have to enter the correct password and click on the next option. On clicking the next button, you will be asked to reset the device first. This means that the Wi-Fi MCB which we have now is to be reset because after that only you can connect this device. For this, you can see a knob is given here. I am zooming in so you can easily see the knob. First you have to push this button downwards and after waiting for few seconds push this button upwards. You can see this indication starts blinking. If this indication is blinking fastly then it means your MCB is generating Wi-Fi signal to connect with Wi-Fi. I am clicking on next now and you will be asked whether indication is blinking fastly or slowly. It is blinking fastly, so I will click on blink quickly. On clicking this option, it will start connecting with this MCB. As you can see, my cell phone is now connected with this Wi-Fi MCB. MCB is written over here because I previously connected my phone with this MCB. When you connect for first time, something else may be written over here. You can change the name by clicking over here. For now, let it be MCB. Now. Click on done and you will see an option MCB here. After selecting this, a page will open. You can see a page is now opened here and here you will see switch option. On selecting this, our MCB will be switched on. On again pressing the option, MCB will be switched off. This means to switch on MCB with this cell phone, 
we press here and on again pressing it will switch off you can see 240 volt is showing here which means 240 volt input voltage is supplied to this mcb some more benefits of using this mcb are you can set the under voltage by yourself and you can also change it similarly you can also change over voltage setting during over voltage condition whether you want tripping or alarm or shut you can select as you want similarly for under voltage also you can change your setting time delay for over voltage as well as the time delay for under voltage can also be changed with this setting so we finally understood how this mcb can be operated with the help of this phone now if you want to operate this mcb with your voice command then you need either alexa or google assistant or smart things type of features for now i am using google assistant every cell phone has google assistant so you can easily use this i already downloaded google assistant and google home on my phone if you want to operate mcb with voice command then you need to download these two apps after downloading if you click on google assistant you will be asked to select link with google assistant option after clicking on this home screen of google assistant will be displayed i am selecting link option now it is showing link your tuya smart account with google which means google assistant is asking for the permission to access your app which is used to operate this mcb so i am clicking on agree now our mcb is connected to google assistant with the app you can see an option of voice command here i am minimizing for now okay if i simply press my home button on phone voice command option is displayed and now i will generate a voice command hello google please turn on the mcb all right turning on mcb now i will give command to turn off hello google please turn off the mcb okay turning off mcb one thing you keep in mind is that the name of mcb you given over here like i given the name of mcb as mcb only if i change the name let's say bulb i changed the name as bulb and saved so i named this mcb as bulb so i am giving command as hello google please turn on the bulb you seen just now that i given the command for bulb to turn on and the mcb is turned on if i want to turn this off then i will say turn off the bulb so you understood that how with the help of voice command this mcb can be easily operated friends i hope you like this video if you like the video please do like share comment on the video and if you didn't subscribe my channel till now please subscribe my channel thank you for watching the video